On the top left, a black and brown fly wiggles whilst mounted on the back of another fly. At the top right, a pale grey tortoise, mounted on the shell of another, slowly leans forward and quickly jerks backwards. In the bottom half, a still image of two worms resting side by side, connected by a sticky white substance. On-screen text reads, Animals mate in all sorts of ways. A black and brown bedbug crawls upward across interwoven strands of white fabric. On-screen text reads, Some more surprising than others. A woman in glasses talks to the camera. On-screen text reads, Erica McAllister, museum scientist. When bedbugs mate, they don't do it in the traditional way. The camera pans up over a still image of a bedbug's golden brown, dagger-like penis. The male's penis is quite extraordinary. It's shaped a bit like a dagger, and he uses this to pierce through her body. An animation shows a dark brown bedbug crawl upward and stop in the middle of the image. Simultaneously, a light brown bedbug crawls from right to left and rests sideways on top of the first bedbug, before they both wiggle from side to side. He generally pierces through her abdomen and the sperm is transferred there and it has to migrate to her ovaries where they fertilize the awaiting eggs. They then come out in the traditional fashion. A bed bug atop white fabric repeatedly kicks its front legs and its upper body rises into the air. Bed bugs aren't the only animals to practice what we call traumatic insemination. We see this in lots of other insects and other creatures such as worms and sea slugs. An end screen scans over a close-up still image of a bedbug's penis, surrounded by clear strands of upright hair. On the left-hand side, a narrow semi-opaque black rectangle displays the credits. Film, Benjamin Weber, Khalil Furloway. Science, Erica McAllister. Archive, Shutterstock, Science Photo Library. Music, Audio Network. At the top right is Photo Copyright, Power and Syred slash Science Photo Library, consisting of the words Natural History Museum, displayed in a column flanked by a large letter N on the left. Text at the bottom reads, copyright owned by the trustees of the Natural History Museum, London.